Hello everybody. Uh, we are at Morris Campgrounds right now in Morris, Illinois. Uh, this is the first private campground that we are going to be camping at. So we're going to give you an idea of what it looks like. It is along the Illinois River and they offer kayaking as well. They have a lot of kayaks on site that you can rent, which is cool. Uh, one thing that was also cool was that you could buy your bundle of wood in advance with them. So we pulled up, we checked in, and said, yeah, we, we uh, pre-ordered a bundle of wood, and they had that ready for us too. So we're going to make a fire tonight. And uh, yeah, I mean, this looks pretty pretty okay. We've got, <laughs> we've got our tarps. It's no more rustic than if we were backcountry. No. I mean, it's rustic. Uh -huh. and, but it feels like backcountry opposed to state park. Mm, yeah, yeah. Here, yeah. And I guess we just put our tents here. Right into the mud. This is campsite 19. We're second to the end. And if you spin around, you can see some of the other people. So this is the Illinois River. Pretty, pretty dirty. It's not swimming, swimming friendly. I don't think rivers are never swimming friendly. Uh huh. So I mean, rivers this big. Um, when I was in middle school. I went to camp along a river, along the Illinois River, as a matter of fact. Okay, hey, here we are. Further downstream. And uh, in Campsville, Illinois, for those people who have been down to Campsville, Illinois. And uh, the big warning was, I mean, you can like be here, but you can't go out there because there's trees, there's logs that are under, they're submerged. Uh -huh. And they'll just grab you. Like to just rip you up? Or? No, they'll suck you down. They'll they'll grab onto you, and like you're you're trapped now on a log that's floating downstream. Oh, okay, okay. So the tree is is not stationary. No. It's, well, it's even worse. I mean, it's bad if it is stationary because the current will suck you under. Yeah. And it's bad if it's floating because it'll just take you. It'll take you with. Yeah. Well, Frogger figured out a way to make that in his favor. Because you would have to jump on the floating logs. Oh yeah. And jump across. There you go. Good reference. So if well, you that's dig dag. I was just thinking. <laughs> yeah, dig dag. yeah. Dig dag. <laughs> yeah. Dig dug, yeah. Dig dug. Uh huh. <laughs> so if you were kayaking out on the Illinois River and you capsized you would want to get back up just get back up as quick as you can yeah. i think the secret is don't capsize mm. that's a pretty good current i wouldn't coming back upstream is going to be a a paddle true uh what about infl how do we feel about inflatable tubes not really down the illinois this is a big river <laughs> it is kind of a big river it's not like the Wisconsin River. Wisconsin River? That's where you go r rafting and canoeing and, and... Like Fox River? Well, Wisconsin River is uh, in Wisconsin. I don't know Wisconsin River. Uh, that, I think, is the what feeds into Devil's Lake. That could be. But you, when you were a kid, we went up there and did a couple of different, different years kayaking and tubing mm. for the day. It's a big, it's a, it's a lot of water. <laughs> so all those smaller rivers we've been on, the Plains, Fox, well, the Kankakee, I guess the Kankakee dribbles into here, right? Yeah, the Kankakee, what is it? The Kankakee and the Des Plains meet mm -hmm. and... Okay, yeah. And then, there, and then it's the Illinois? Yeah. 
pink. All right. Yeah. Let's go kill a hike somewhere. All right. Where are we hiking today? I don't have the name off the top of my head. All right. We're going to hike today. Yeah.